Welcome to Stingy K TV. Make sure you press that subscribe button. And don't forget to press the like button. So today, I'm going to be dropping these Warzone settings for y'all, man. So y'all could be moving beastly and aggressively out here, man. And the first thing I need y'all to do, I need y'all to go pick up one of these Pro Wireless controllers with the paddles. It's going to improve your gameplay a lot. So first, we're going to start off with our controller settings. Normal. I play on tactical. I don't know about you guys, but I play on tactical. I got the bumper ping off, off, default off. I got my dead zones to eight, 108, 101 and one. I know a lot of people that make videos all day and they lie and they say they put this on zero. It's on 90, it's cap, bro. This is not gonna work, bro. You're gonna be swinging around, getting thrashed. And that's what my video for today is to help you guys stop getting thrashed. So if you put it on eight, as you can see, I have it on. It's fine. And then after I show you these other settings, we're gonna go and I'm gonna show you guys how I move. So I got my horizontal stick on nine. And I got it on 0.70 right here. But you could easily triangle or Y, hold it, and it'll just go to the regular. I put my vertical stick sensitivity on 8 and my ADS multiplier on 0 0.50. This is for the console players. This is for the PC players. So I'm going to start off with my console players first. So I got my target aim assist on and I got my aim assist type on default. And then I got my monitor sensor, sensor aiming, <laughs> my motion sensor aiming on off. So now for my PC players, like I was saying earlier, 0 0.70, 0 0.70, 0 0.50 for the ADS multiplier and the sensitivity multiplier. I, I didn't really change none of this. I really don't tweak with that. I got all this on standard on the vertical aim axis. Tactical stance. I don't even I hate that tactical stance. I turn it off and it just still comes on and I got my aim response curve type to dynamic That's gonna give you like a hit scan like they're gonna think you got aim aim bot. They're gonna think you got the hack on bro And you just go along with it and tell them you do just troll them. That's what I do ADS sensitivity multiplier right here. I got it on 1.0 and I got my sensitivity transition timing on instant. Easy. Then I got my custom sensitivity per zoom off. But when I do play with it, these are my settings. But I don't play with it, so. But if you play with it, here they are. This is like for the snipers and stuff of that, you like going crazy. I got target aim assist on, aim assist type default. <clears throat> I know they used to say Black Ops and it been nerfed since Warzone 2. And then that's basically everything for the aiming slider. So next we're going to go to the gameplay. So I got automatic sprint. I got it on automatic tactical sprint. I got the slide maintain sprint. I got it off. Auto move forward off. Tactical sprint behavior. Single tap sprint. Automatic airborne mantle. <clears throat> I have that on. Automatic grand mantle. I have that off. I also got my slide behavior on slide only. I got plunging underwater on the trigger. I got parachute automatic behavior for free fall. Sprinting door bash on. Mantle only on the ledge climb behavior. And the aim down sight behavior on hold. Basically everything else just normal and then I, <clears throat> I have my inner eyes reload interact reload behavior my bad Why edit it out just leave it. I'm gonna just leave it in there Shit. But I have it on prioritize interact so I could just tap and I could hold it to reload so you know Then I had that on basically everything is just the same 
Now we're gonna get into some gameplay. I've been using this tech evolve lately. This I'm I'm gonna drop the class at the end of this video. But this thing's a monster. So we're gonna go to the dummy settings. Tell me, bro. Look at this shit. What more could you ask for, bro? Now, this is the loadout right here. This is the squad wiper. I call this the squad wiper. It's the big dog. Oh, my goodness. This thing is insane, bro. Let me move this a little bit for you guys so you guys can see. So, what you want to do is... <clears throat> So I, I use the VT7 Spitfire for the muzzle, and I use this Hey 70 short barrel melter. And I'll use the Corio Eagle's Eye 2.5X. And I put the Rampart Heavy Start with the FS Combo Grip. <clears throat> Monster. And for my secondary, I'm running a striker with the Jack BFB, striker recon, the Nadar model, no stock, and a 60 round drum. It melts. Enemies are dropping into the area. Time's over, now you deploy to the war zone. Soldier incoming.
enemies are dropping into the area. Watch the skies. Returning you to the front. Earn this. Enemy soldier incoming. Hi, cabron. Too close. Drop inbound. Dropping into the AO. If you made it this far in the video, I like to thank you and appreciate you for coming through and uh, tuning in with the Stingy Gang, man. So what I need you to do is to watch one of them videos that's on the screen, man. Tap in, tap in, and don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below.